nothing like a nice chocolate pudding pie. When I was growing up, this is all we ever used to eat. Chocolate pudding pie in the morning, chocolate pudding pie for lunch, chocolate pudding pie for dinner. You know, it's nothing like it. I'm gonna make it. But you're gonna need this. Get the non-GMO one. It's not got any crap in it and it's clean-ish. Okay, now, two cups of milk, half a cup of sugar, two teaspoons of vanilla extract, though I like to put about three in because I do like to do that, and three tablespoons of cornstarch, and that's it. And then we're gonna go into the microwave with this, so it's, it's you know, it's, it's foolproof. Also, you're gonna need that. Chocolate cocoa powder. Organic. Organic is very clean till you start to eat it, it gets around your mug. First, make sure you get a microwave bowl. Plastic one is good, that's what I'm using. Half a cup of the sugar goes in there. Then you want three tablespoons of cornstarch. Three tablespoons. Then a quarter of a cup of the cocoa powder goes in there as well. Then we're adding our vanilla. Two teaspoons, but as I say, I like to use three. That's like about four, but I love it. Then we're gonna slowly whisk in the milk. When that's all done, in the microwave, on high, three minutes. When that's done, out the microwave, stir it up again, and we put it back in for another four minutes. You should end up with something like this that resembles a pudding. See, that's about the right consistency. And it isn't four minutes, it's actually three minutes you put it back in for. They were wrong. <laughs> but anyway, it looks good. And then put it in the fridge for four or five hours.